Yo, what's going on guys? Welcome back to another episode of Just Another Skyblock. Um, as you can see off camera, I did a lot of work to uh, the base. Basically what I ended up doing was making like a 5x5 five five, uh, tree farm. So 1, 2, 3, 4, 5 dirt right here and then 5 there so we can plant 25 saplings. Um, but yeah, I, I had to expand the base a little bit just so we get more like if like the leaves break and saplings drop, they don't fall off the edge. Also, I ended up placing down some more barrels so I could get dirt faster and it rained. Um, so yeah, these two barrels are full of water, and these two as well. Like in the chest, there's a bunch of crazy stuff, so I've got a bunch of ore. If you put like the, uh, I'm pretty sure it's I think cobblestone, or you put in some dirt right here into the sieve, into the flint one, you'll get the um, ore pieces back, and then you just put four, and you'll get an ore chunk right here. Also made some charcoal, and also if you put some leaves right here in the, the string sieve, you can get like some other stuff back. So I got like a bunch of different types of seeds and some different saplings, which is really clutch. But um, yeah, to start us off, I'm just gonna smelt down all this stuff. Um, I ended up yeah just grinding a lot off camera, at least over an hour. But now we can do a lot more of the fun stuff during this episode. So I think the best thing to do is continue with some of these achievements. I think we're gonna go for the clay and buckets, giving buckets, baby making clay is pretty easy just put a dust block in it so obtain water in a clay bucket okay easy enough let's uh check right here clay oh dang can't spell clay bucket okay unfired clay bucket it's just three clay oh that's easy okay so where's the clay at though i guess we don't have any clay I made bricks, yeah. Maybe. I guess, yeah, we're gonna have to get some more clay. Let's check it, because I'm pretty sure. What do we get from here? We get like stone pebbles. Can we put cobblestone in there? No. Pretty sure we gotta put some of this other stuff. We could just hammer this all the way down. Hi guys, now that this is hammered all the way down um, into dust, we actually just need some water in this thing right here. So yeah, we'll fill that up with some oak leaves, and then we've got to put the dust in and it'll be there. Hi right, guys, the water's done, so bang, let's put this in, let's get this clay. Bang. It's this one right here. Bang. That let out. We're getting some more ores going. Let's get it. Let's have this one finish up right here. Let's, let's see. Clay bucket. Perfect. And then we can just grab water. Yoink. There we go. That's sick. Okay, I guess we have like buckets now so we don't have to make like an iron bucket. Um, Let's check what else we got right here. Okay, so this will be useful. Obtain a lava clay bucket. Okay, so what do we do? To make porcelain mix clay balls with bone meal. So I feel like we're gonna need more clay. Or some more, um, yeah, actually clay. We'll put this back here. We'll see what this says. I so to make porcelain mix, mix clay balls with bone meal. Porcelain mix. Porcelain clay. Okay, cool, cool. Uh, well, me now craft an unfired crucible and then fire it. The last step is placing the crucible on a torch and put four cobblestone in it. It will take a while, but when it's finished, okay, cool. All right, guys, so to make what we need right here, the unfired crucible for the cobblestone generator, we are gonna need some more bones. So I guess this means that we are going to have to make right here a mob farm. Ooh. <laughs> oh. <sighs> oh god. Alright, let's see. We need 24. 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10, 11, 12, 13, 14, 15, 16, 17, 18, 19, 20, 21, 22, 23, 24, 5, 6. Alright, so I think we're just going to do like Oh god, a basic one for right now. Basic farm, nothing too complex. 
Um, just enough to get us going. What's this one? What's this one right here? All right, cool. We're just gonna need a basic farm. And the reason I did leaves out over there is just because these are transparent blocks, so mobs can't spawn on them. Um, so the best thing that we could do right now is we could probably build it out of just like oak planks. So we need some more. And what's interesting about this mod pack is every torch requires one piece of charcoal. So I guess we'll craft like eight torches right now. That should be enough. And then let's get going on making this farm right here. Let's grab this up. Yoink. Put that one in. Put this right here. And then I'm not too sure how we want to do this. So we'll grab some planks up. I guess this will work right here. We'll just try to make it work. See what we want to do. So I'm guessing like one, two. Oh my gosh. Three, four, five, six, seven. Wait, one, two, three, four, five. So it's gonna be twelve. Two, three, four, five. Alright. I'm just gonna make it like twelve by six. That's kind of like weird, but it'll work. But I think for this one, I kind of, I'm thinking of like this idea right here, this like kind of design. I'll show you guys in a second. No, actually, no, no, oh, no, come on. Oh God. Oh no. It's not gonna happen. I'm gonna die. Come on. Come on. Come on. Oh god. Come on. Please. No. Oh, what the f. <clears throat> What'd we lose? We didn't lose much, actually. Okay, perfect. I mean, I don't mind. Get our hunger back. We just lost some levels, but levels don't matter right now. And we got the torches back. Dang. Okay. What did we lose? We lost like pickaxe. See, okay, we lost a bunch of stuff that doesn't really matter that much right now. Um, kind of sucks a little bit, but it happens. All right, let's get this done then. So I think something like this. I got any of these planks? So we can't duck under those. Alright, let's check, let's check. Oh, okay. Okay, just like feel comfortable. It's flat part two. We're gonna break this off a little bit. Alright, so I think this is kind of like what I'm going for right here. Um so let's see. We'd run it like what this high? This should work. Maybe, hopefully. Okay, yeah, perfect. This is exactly what I wanted, because now it's like dark in here, you know what I mean? So we're actually just gonna put one torch in there for right now. Because, oh, whoops, we'll leave that open, we'll do this, because maybe, okay, now, we're going to go check this out right here, we're going to go see about these, like, wooden hoppers, um, let's check it, so let's see if wooden hoppers work the same way, we're just going to need this, dope, oh, we're going to need an extra chest, perfect, Oh, man. 
Let's go, baby. All right, so warden hoppers work just how we need them to. And we're only going to need them um, for like the middle row. So maybe we'll make like five or so. I don't know. Start with five. We'll see how that goes. So let's go see what these hoppers do. So we're gonna need one more hopper to make this. All right, so let's just do this, you know? Let's just get a crafting station going over here. Why not? And then we have an extra chest. This is perfect. Let's get this one hopper going. Perfect. And just test, bang. Oh, there we go, perfect. Let's go, guys. Alright, so let's put this right here. No torches are in here, right? This right. Oh no, I messed it up. I messed up the order. So I think this should be fine right here. This should work out. But I guess we'll just have to wait and see. Oh, what? I wait for those mobs to get going. We could try to do something. Alright, so I think we're on our way to this one's lava bucket. Um, this is kind of like a mob farm right here. So I guess if we want, we could check out the armory. Like, why not? Let's see it. Armory. Oh. Alright, so armory. Let's check. Armor station? Okay, this could work. Four blank patterns and a crafting station. Okay. Let's do it. Crafting station, armor station. Cool. Let's put this right here. Okay, helmet core, armor plates, armor trim. Guess what that's in here. Yeah, right here. So we're probably gonna need some more stencils. So let's let's just grab up like what eight more stencils. I think that should work. And then we're gonna need four. We're gonna need like helmet core, chest plate core. Legging core, boots core, and what else do we need with it that this one said? Helmet core, armor plates and armor trim. Okay, so we're going to need two more. So armor plates and armor trim. Armor trim, cool. And then armor plate. Let's go, baby. All right. And this one. Can we make, let's just check this. Okay, tool station. Which one was it? Part builder right here, cool. All right, let's get this going. So we're gonna need four. Let's go grab the rest of this wood. Put the rest in, so let's for armor trim, so we don't need any more armor trim. Armor plates, one, two, three, four. Perfect. And then we just need one of each type of armor. So leggings, boots. We already got the chest plate, so now we just need the helmet. Cool. And let's just go store. Oh, if you just click on it with this, it just like stores it automatically. That's cool. I mean, this is a little faster, but that'll, that'll work. All right, so let's just let's just craft everything. Oh, that's the pattern right there. Let's put that one away. All right, armor trim. We need this one. Oh, these ones are switched. Okay, wooden helmet. Okay, wooden chest plate. Wooden leggings. And wooden boots. Let's go, baby. Armory. Um, you have enabled rotation lock. I have no clue what that is or how I enabled that. Press K. Okay, cool. 
Oh, I see that. Okay, cool, cool. So, dang, there's armory done right there. That's dope. And now we got our first set of armor. Whoa, we look like a brick right now. Jeez. So, these are kind of sick. I wonder how we get XP. Maybe just, like, killing mobs or something. I have no clue. All right, so this is what we're going to settle with right now for this room. Maybe we can make a bigger change of the design. I just want, like, kind of something basic right now, you know? Nothing, like, that actually looks that good. Just something where we can get some mobs going. We'll make a better one later. Um, so, yeah, for right now, I guess we'll come back here in a minute. And hopefully stuff spawned in. It's becoming night. So that's cool. But I guess we could just continue with some of these achievements right here. Um, which we're going to try the more seething one, which is obtain ancient spores. I guess we could just do that through time. So there's nothing that really could, like make us do that really quick. Um, so we're going to go for rotate and dismantle before getting into machines and energy. Obtain a crescent hammer. Let's check it. Crescent hammer. All right. Okay. One tin and three iron, which I think we have, but I don't know if. Oh, we don't have tin, huh? We have a tin ore piece, or is it in here? It is in here. So we have just enough with one leftover iron, but I don't know if we want to spend our iron. Oh, and I forgot to put a torch on the roof. First mob fight, let's go, baby. Okay, I'll take it. What do we got? Is there a zombie in there? right there oh my what if i just like break this one oh make this like a half slab that doesn't help at all oh god oh knock back on that so i'm pretty sure that won't work right there I guess we could do like some more of these alongside here. Like, why not? So, what we just like place a slab right here, and then a slab right here, and we're good. We chilling, baby. All right. So let's see. Oh, this will work right here. I guess I, I think this is definitely good enough. Um. Let's get this torch going up here. Just to know that we're not messing around. We ain't trying to get mobs in our house. Alright, let's go back, baby. Oh, we are starting to get hungry. Um, I just want to see rotten fresh graveyard soil. Heals undead. I don't think we want that. Get blood from it. That's kind of gross. Um, put on the compost. I guess we'll just leave this for now. Um, we'll put it up here. And we can leave, could leave some blank patterns in there. I guess we can. Um, that's good. It seems like the mob farm kind of works, maybe. I, mean, I don't know. We got two zombies so far, but really right now we just need like some skeletons for the most part. So I guess I'll just AFK here for a little bit. All right, guys, I'm back. And it's only been a little bit, but still no mob spawns. So I guess we could just wait for them. And then maybe make like a giant room or we'll make some better designs. But I think now that we have this, one thing that we could do that would be kind of cool. So we could just make an infinite water source. I'm just going to place this down just in case I fall breaking this last one. All right, cool, we're good. So, let's see if this works or if there's like, so it seems to be that there's like a different way. There's no infinite water source in this. Which kind of sucks a little bit, but it's fine. I guess we'll just leave the water there for now. It's whatever. Um, at least like cover that up. But let's just see 
we kind of just have to wait for like some bones honestly so we'll get like some other challenges down i mean we need bone and uh some bones and gunpowder to finish that one we could start on that but i don't know if i want to spend the iron on that i mean let's just do it why not it's full sign baby let's get we need this 110 we need three iron let's see if i can do it from how i remember it it was like something okay i don't remember okay it's like that cool perfect crescent hammer oh god so i have no clue how this thing works some um, bones going oh okay could this guy hit me for me come on dude wait oh my let's just break that let's just try to okay this is more than enough Come on, bones, bones. Are you serious? Alright, so I guess if we break this one open right here. If we do this, we can hit everything. But we didn't get any bones, unfortunately. So I guess what we could do is we could just like... Place a bunch of stuff alongside this. I mean, because it'll look like a cool path and we could light it up later. But for now, we want to try to get, like, some mob spawns going, so... Let's just place a bunch of these down, and then hopefully we can get some mob spawning on these. Who knows? Oh, it's coming day. Oh, God. I guess that means we're probably going to have to make a more efficient mob spawner. I'm down to do, but eh, I mean that'll that'll just take a while. Wish we could we could do it. All right, this looks kind of sick though, right here. Not gonna lie. We should have enough for this. Oh god, messed up. All right, so yeah, we got this going at least. So it's pretty sick. Not gonna lie. But we don't have any mobs in here. All right, guys, I'm doing a quick voiceover of this clip right here. Basically, what I ended up doing was changing the mob farm around and made, like, a bigger, a little better design that I used um, just in, like, an original Skyblock from a couple years ago. Um, I changed it up just because I waited at least, like, 30 minutes to an hour, and we were barely getting any mobs with the mob farm we had. So, yeah, that's basically all I did off-cam just so we could speed it up and get some more achievements done. But, yeah, I have another clip for you guys, and the video's not done yet, so enjoy. All right, guys, welcome back. And right now, I actually finished up this right here. So I changed the mob farm design. Um, all right, guys, so I just finished killing up some of the mobs right there. I'm actually gonna need to do the tiniest modification to them. I wanna try this out and see if this works. Um, what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna put two more slabs because I think from where they are right now, the mobs can see me. So the creepers and stuff could still like blow up like that, yeah. Which I don't want to happen. So I think like this. I think this is the safest right here. The only problem is right now. Okay, so we can have everything still. So I'm gonna do a little bit of modification to this just to make sure that around all here it'll be like this. Just so we have full 360 around these guys. But it seems to be working pretty well. And I designed it like this so we can get more than just the mob drops. So I wanted to get the XP as well. Just in case I need XP, you know. It doesn't hurt. So, yeah, right now we already got a ton of stuff going, which is great. Um, we'll take some of this. And we'll try to finish one more quest and that'll be the rest of this video. But don't worry, guys. The next couple videos are going to be really packed and really good for this. And I also have a huge project coming up and got a new mic. So the mic quality and, like, the sound quality is going to be way better. Um, and I got a lot more I'm working on. So what we wanted to work on was this one right here. The lava clay bucket. So we needed that porcelain mix, right? So let's go check this. Porcelain mix. Okay, so we need clay and bone meal, which now we have a ton of bones for the bone meal. The only problem is we don't have 
some of this dust that we need. Okay, so it wasn't this one. I think actually we can maybe use cobble. I want to try to get some dust. Um, okay, yeah, it is cobble. So yeah, cobble inside gravel, gravel goes into sand, and then sand goes into dust. It sucks that this process is pretty long, and I know we can automate this later on, but for now we're going to have to deal with this, unfortunately. Take it back to play. Destroy these two. And porcelain mix. Let's see, so... We need seven. Okay, so that means seven pieces of clay. And seven bone meal. And we got eight, perfect. And we'll just make this. So we'll just make eight for now. Eight porcelain. Um, porcelain clay. We need this. Let's go make this, perfect. And then, let's go see what this one said. So it said, um, now craft an unfired crucible and then fire it. The last step is by placing the crucible. So I'm guessing we just put this in here to make a fired crucible. And let's see what the last step is. Uh, the last step is placing the crucible on a torch and put four cobblestone in it. It will take a while, okay. So four cobble. We have one torch, which is perfect. So I guess we could just like place that torch down there and place it on top of there. Okay. Perfect. Okay, four cobblestone, so it's coming back to lava. So I'll be right back when it's uh, done converting to lava. All right, guys, I'm back, and I'm pretty sure that the lava's done right now. So there we go. Okay, perfect. So now that we have lava bucket and water bucket, you know what that means, boys. We can make a cobblestone generator and can finally start using cobblestone a little more. Um, especially now that we have the mob farm, I've been needing some cobblestone um, just so I can repair my stuff because my sword, I've actually had to repair it a couple times while I've been over here. And I've been here for maybe like five minutes and we already have like crazy amount of drops. So I think this mob farm is definitely a success. Um, for right now, I'm just going to end it for this episode. I know we didn't do much, but trust me, guys, stay tuned. Uh, these next couple of episodes are going to be packed. There's going to be a lot more happening. Um, and yeah, also I'm going to be getting a better mic, uh, within a couple days. So I'll, the quality of all the videos is going to go way higher up. Um, and I'm not planning on uploading daily. Like I was last week. I'm going to be trying to upload every other day around. Um, so yeah, I have a, a ton of episodes planned out. And off camera, I'm going to do some more grinding, like I'll grind over there. Um, I'll get some more wood and trees because we used a lot of wood building that right there. Um, as you can see, we already have a ton of dirt. So I'll just do like some of the boring basic grinding off cam. And next episode is going to be really packed because we got a lot of the basics. So the boring basics are done. Now we get to the fun part of the mod pack, which is actually like the mods and exploring with it. Well, that's going to do it for today's episode, guys. Thank you so much for watching, and I'll catch you guys within the next two days or so. Peace.